Welcome back everybody, this is Danny Code, and we are continuing on with some colony survival here. And I did a boo-boo. I made a mistake. I recorded a whole episode without turning on the mute mic. Well, the mic was on, but the mute button was on. So nothing got recorded as far as, you know, audio. So I'm just going to go over kind of what I did real quick, and then we'll get on with uh, what we're going to do here. And I do have a few goals, like, uh, so I did notice that, actually, we'll explain what we're doing and then I'll catch up. So I noticed that I don't really have any building material things except for mud bricks, which are fine, but mud bricks and, 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 and planks, mud bricks and planks. So again, which would be fine, but I kind of want to build out like these walls here into something other than like these bushes, <laughs> basically. So I want it to like look like a start look like a castle. And uh, yeah, so let me. You know what I need to put here? I need to put a thing. I need to put a thing down just here so I can get up on this wall. Okay. So yeah. So what I want to do is I want to do building materials. That's what I'm saying. So in the science here, I noticed that we have like a few things. We have like the brick. I think the brick guy like these bricks here. And we can do like these two bricks and that's fine. Uh, we can have the builder, which he, he can actually build things for us. But what I'm really looking for, and I found it just a minute ago, is the stone mason. So these are the, really the things that I want right now. So I want like the stone brick and the black, all these other types of bricks. So we can have like this one, I would make the, the cobblestone, I would make the the castle walls, I guess we're going to call it. I would make the castle walls out of those because they, they look like castle wall bricks, right? And this actually opens up tiled roofs and things like that. So that's that's kind of my goal here. And it looks like we need the anvil, which we need to still research that. And we also need the tailor. So, and we need to research that. So we need, we need to get more wheat and we need to get more leather. So leather, leather, that's a good question. Oh, it's in the tanner. So we're gonna need to get animal carcasses. And to get animal carcasses, how do we get those? How do we get the animal carcasses? Um, well, oh, I can actually do a merchant's hub as well. I don't know if we can buy animal carcasses. Oh, so here. So recipe recipe unlock. Well, we need animal carcasses, so we don't have those. I'm not really sure how to get them, to be honest with you. Porridge. So let's just look at things here. So we have archery, tool distribution, writer, cook, statistics, scribe, copper lockbox, stone mason. I just saw a zombie come by there. <laughs> Sacred failsafe, grocery shop. I wish these were broken down into categories. It would be a lot easier to find something. So I, I'm looking for like a hunter, right? Is that what I'm looking for? Archimedean screw removes water in the local area. Deeply re realistic way. Okay, digger. Uh, bricks, bread. I thought I saw... Hmm, builder. Hmm. Point storage, outposts, crossbows, projectile trap. Mm. Oh, chicken meals unlocks more complex. Chicken. We need barley. Chicken meals and candle. Chicken. So we need chicken. So, uh, oh, you remember? I remember now. There was like a chicken coop or something like that. So, looking, looking, looking. Local animal carcass. Provides source for local animal carcasses. So, what do we need for this? Requires chicken meals and a researcher. All right, so we'll need the researcher. Well, you know, I may not be able to get the building stuff just right away, but at least we're getting an idea of what we need. But this is weird. So, book of knowledge, chicken meals. So... Hmm. 
Steel and lead minerals. Is there an easier way to get chicken meals? I'm not seeing it. So again, I wish these were... I wish these were... Oh! Oh, 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 It just occurred to me. It just occurred to me. I think it's a job. Let's look at the jobs real quick. Here we go. Flax farmer, hemp farmer, construction chicken farmer. There it is. There it is. That's what I'm looking for. And we also have our beekeeper. Obviously not going to help us with uh, animal carcasses, but... Uh, the chicken farmer requires chicken meals to be unlocked first. So I think... I think that is the one we're going to have to go for here is the chicken farmer. Now, if I'm looking at the research, so chicken farmer, chicken meals. So we need, we need bread. Bread needs a cook and a scribe. Oh boy. Okay. Even to get that's going to be, it's going to be a stretch. Okay. Well, that's our goal though. I don't know if I'm going to get the building materials in this episode. But we're going to work our way up to it. Definitely work our way up to it. So, yeah, we're just going to continue on seeing what we can do here. Anvil is going to be the first thing that we're going to need to unlock, I think. Well, that requires leather, so that's not going to that's not going to do it. That's we're not going to oh, so hmm. Cooked meat, raw meat. So, I'm just kind of curious where we get the raw meat. It has to be the chicken farmer, right? Porridge and Taylor. Okay, so we're just going to go on and doing what we're doing here and progress. I did put a new wheat farm in here, and I'll show you exactly what I did in the last unrecorded episode. So we had three. I put another wheat farmer in here. So we got that going. So we should get more wheat here fairly soon. I also put in... I also enclosed the production folks here because we're, we're pretty full up and I also have here uh, if I can do the right thing there there we go we have here we have a a job block crafter so he's doing job blocks and he doesn't have anything to do at the moment but that's our new production and we're doing pottery as well. So we need the pot pots to make water. And we do, I'll show you where, where, where I put that. And basically I enclosed these guys because I'm going to put the next bit of storage or the next bit of production up here. So our next production, like whatever we get unlocked, is going to go up here. And I also put a second story on the, the barracks. I'm gonna, I guess I'm going to call them and some stairs down to the barracks under there. So everybody that wants to sleep outside can sleep outside, and, every <laughs> and everybody that wants to not sleep outside can sleep in here and have a, a nice old time there. Uh, the other thing I did was I put water collection here. So these guys are collecting water. Now they collect water as long as they have pots. So they put the water in the pot and that they collect the water and I also cleared all this out this was this was what you call it this was all kind of water here and I and as you can see I cleared it out and that is the line of friendly the friendly line of like inside the colony and outside the colony so there's that and I also expanded the maze just a bit so now we have this little bit here and we also have the old part of the maze, which is this. So the zombies, the zombies, have much further way to go to get into the colony. And that's it. I think I think that gets you guys up to up to uh, up to speed. I don't think I did anything down here. No, nope, everything is good down here. I did put in some extra jobs here, so I have an extra clay. And an extra copper there. I think I put those in the last episode. The one that I, I actually didn't hit the mute button on. So yeah, that is it. So, alright. So our first thing is, what do we need 
I really want to get this science done. So what do we need here? So we need the tailor and we just need a bunch more wheat. So I'm going to put, I think, one more wheat farm just kind of in this area. Yeah, I'll put one more. Well, the other thing I can do is I could put, I could start doing a wheat farm down here, I think. What I'm going to do, okay, so I'm going to do a little jump cut here. I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, like, just dig out a big enough space for a wheat farm. And let me just look here. So we're, we can't, I don't want to go that way. So I can actually go that way and maybe put the wheat farms underneath. The other thing I can do actually too is I can do a two stack wheat farm. So basically put, yeah, I think that's what I, I want to do. So we'll do this. So I'm going to put, these will be the second story. The beginning of the second story just like that and i could put a weed farm here but it won't fit uh perfectly so i don't want to do that and i'll show you what i'm doing here so we're going to go ahead and put these in we're going to mark these out for the new for the second story and i'm going to put it i'm going to go up instead of it down i think let's go ahead and let's take this out we're going to make all of this a wall Actually. And up until up until there. Up until there. So let's make this the a wall. Uh, again, I wish I had the right right building materials, but that's okay. We'll be fine. We'll be good. And make that up into a wall. We need this too high so the zombies don't get in. Like so. All right. And then we'll make this like the stairs up. So, um, how far do I want to make this? I want to make it four tall, right? So let's do four, we'll do three, this is three tall. And on the fourth one, we'll put this, will be the ceiling. Do like that, oops, I want to do that. There we go, and up we go. So this will be, this will be the ceiling and yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a little time lapse here. We'll build this up and I'll show you exactly what I'm, uh, what I'm doing. You're probably like, what the heck is he doing? I will show you what I'm doing. Well, we're gonna do a little time cut here, or a time lapse here and I'll be right back.
All right. How do you like it? <laughs> it is our second story of wheat farms. And now we can double up our wheat farm production. And I know it seems silly, but I mean, it seems like unnatural because these actually need like sun. But I, I'm just imagining that these are grow lamps, right? That's so the immersion, the immersion is still there. So these are miracle grow lamps, literally. <laughs> What I'm gonna do, let's put let's put one on here as well. Just so it makes it look like, you know. Makes it look like it's purposeful. But yeah, so that so that's it. I think I I think I made it one too far this way, but that doesn't matter because we can actually expand one more that way and we should be okay. And it uh, actually looks like we're in the berry farmers way but we're really not because they weren't using this land anyways that 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 part of it but now we have some arable land up here that we can put on wheat farms so and then we, and we can go up uh, as many as you like so you know and i was thinking about putting these this why does this one look larger i got one two three four five six seven eight nine so this one i think is larger than these yeah yeah, pretty much. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, so this one I think is just a bit bigger, but I think I made a mistake there. But it should still work, because I think... Oh, I see. So it should actually be... And I can fix that later. But it should actually be... Let's get a... Mm, uh, go up here. But this is, is too, too far, which makes sense because these are, these ones here are seven and this one is nine. So basically we just made it too, too many here. So what I'll do, yeah, is I will go ahead and start it from here. Oh no, it's not, it's not too big. So why, uh, maybe these are just too small, like too, like small. So those were 99 and these are 77. Okay, so these are just a bit smaller. But you know what? I, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it like that. I, I don't care. It, it's fine. It's fine. Everything will be fine. I may come back and, and redo these later so they're you know like proper size. But uh yeah, it should be fine. Is this one 99? No, it's 77 too. Okay. So that's okay. So we got four new farms here. And that works. And this works as well down underground again i like to ma imagine these are they're grow lamps you know like you're growing something in your closet you know how people do that so i just imagine these are, are grow lamps <laughs> yeah we'll, we'll go with that now how many beds do we have so we have 48 beds and we only have 39 colonists so we, we can definitely do yeah we have unemployed number four and that's the wheat farms so, okay, so let's go ahead and hire for these. It shouldn't put our threat level up too, too much. Nothing that we can't handle. And now we have four more wheat farms. So we should be making buku, buku wheat. Um, I think it kind of looks cool, right? Kind of got a little bit of an overhang here as well, which makes it, gives it a little bit of a design aesthetic. Yeah, I like how they came out. Why not? Let's go ahead and light it up as well. Here, here, this one can go here. Yeah, and that looks better. And also do it over here. Just for consistency, just like that. Yeah, that looks good. I think I really like that actually. It really looks like uh, it, it was meant to be there <laughs> and it's purposeful. Especially with the moon in the background. Very nice. Oh, and by the way, did you guys notice that when I was building that, I was like, well, I have time to take out this wall and like rebuild it with the planks. But uh, I did not. So, <laughs> you know what? I'm going to take this out. Because this is just one row too many. Do something like that. And uh, 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 should be mm. 
Er, actually, no, you know what? I want to put that back. But let's make sure we can climb up here. So we'll just start it like here instead. Yeah, just something like that. That's fine. Okay. Because I keep on trying to climb up this way. Actually, that'll be, that'll be, well, let's just put that row back. I think it's breaking, breaking the immersion a little bit. Uh, it wasn't up this far, was it? Hold on. Technical difficulties here. Give me just one second. There we go. This is the one we wanted. Doop, doop. There we go. Perfect. And I can do something like this as well. Doop. That. And that. And that. That's that. There we go. So now we have a way up. Cool. Okay. Beauty. Alright, so we are at night time. And let's look at our research again. And in the science here, how are we doing here? So yeah, so we just we're just really taking taking the wheat and we're making a lot of it looks like well we only have sixty meals, so Gonna have to keep an eye on that. I thought I had like a hundred of them. Let's go look at our, I think our um, production as well. Yeah, let's go look at what we're doing for meals here. Because I really don't want to run out, start running out of meals because that would kind of suck. Hi guys, how you doing? Good job. Keep it up. Booyah. Alright, so... Meals are being made over here, and so we have, we should have, so they should be making 200, and that's on priority, and we, it's, it's, the thing is that we don't have the wheat, and that's the deal there, and it looks like, uh, let's look at the inventory here, it looks like we only have 30 and 30, yeah, okay, so... We may even want to put some more berry farms up. Uh, the ones we have are fine. I really want to concentrate on wheat, though, because eventually eventually we'll be making bread. So really pushing this production up is going to be, like, the best thing that we've done. And we might as well do this so it makes it easier to get up in here like that. Always nice. Oops, back it up, beep, 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 back it up. There's our new wheat farmers going to work. Uh, sir, you're in my way. Uh, there we go. You can't, I don't think you can click through the colonists. Let's just do that. There we go, perfect. So we have steps there. Let's make some steps on here. Hello, sir. Can I just have access to this here? There we go. Beautiful. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, 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 nice. And I think we have a stairwell here as well. No, we don't. Well, we should though, right? So let's fix this real quick. Oops, not a. Um, you know what? I may put some more berry farms just in here, actually. So let's just get rid of these. And get rid of that as well. And let's go ahead. Hmm, let's go ahead and you know what? We don't need a we don't need stairs here. That looks fine. We'll be fine. All right, let's go ahead and put some more berry farms down, just so we're not running out of those. Oops. And how are we doing this? So it starts kind of there, like that. Is that right? Uh, 
Um, why are these bigger? Hold on. Remove that area. Why? I don't know why I made these as small as I did. But it looks like... Yeah, so how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven by... One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven by six. Huh. Interesting. 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 So we're really not sure why I did that. But I think what we're looking at is that. Alright, well let's go with that. And that should be our next berry farmer. Let's go ahead and hire for that. So again, I don't want to... Yeah, these are both infinite. Okay. But I don't want to uh, run out... I just don't want to run out of meals while these guys are cooking up this this weed up here. So it's going to take a little bit of time for them to actually grow it. I think there's a day. There's a day and then they can start harvesting it. So, which is cool. Okay. By the way, um, as you've noticed, two... I am 70 out of 100. I got I got hit by those zombies. As I said, when I was building this, I took out the wall and I was trying to build it up as fast as possible. But before I could, the zombies had a different idea for me and I got attacked and I got hit by one. And I was like, oh, oh no. And uh, yeah, so definitely want to... Uh, ooh, I want to heal up and I want to stop doing that. So I just fell and I took another 20. Okay. So uh, many of you probably know this, but to heal up, you need just to eat meals. Let's put this back here. Put that back, put those back. So if I go ahead and select this and I think right mouse click. Yeah, right mouse click. No, left mouse click. Right mouse click. There you go. Right and right. And there you go. So I'm going to, and then I'm going to put these right back. So yeah, so that's how you heal up, is eating meals like that. All right. I'm really liking that. That's really kind of kind of good looking. So maybe planks for now is all we need for building materials. I guess that's fine. But I definitely want to make these outside walls out of some sort of stone material. Because that just makes more sense. I'm pretty sure that was... Maybe not more readily available, but it was more period appropriate, like period accurate. Like I think they made things out of stone f a lot quicker, a lot, a lot more than they made things out of wood. But I may be mistaken there. I'm not even sure. I'm not too sure. I'm not entirely sure, guys. Don't know. I don't know what the heck I'm saying. Correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Yeah, it was probably it was probably wood. Now that I'm thinking about it, which by the way, let's check our stocks here. So yeah, we have tons of log templates, right? So we actually probably have. You probably have. You know, I can make the outside out of log walls actually, if I'm if I'm thinking about it. But we actually have buku amounts of foresters with all these guys here. So what we have one, one, two, three, four, five, five foresters, which is probably overkill at this particular point in time, but that's fine. Let me, you know what? How do those wood? I'm just gonna look here. Let's let's look at how they how they look. Maybe we can do these for the for the outside wall here. Uh, let's just do a little test area here. Maybe it's right here. Actually, hmm, put those back. And let's see here. Yeah, because I don't want to dig into the maze just quite yet. So let's just start out here. And replace some of this with the log. Log stuff. Hey guys, how you doing? Collecting that water? Doing an awesome job. You don't have any pots, I see. So maybe, maybe I just want to make the log walls 
first, and that should suffice until we actually do the stone. We'll just do it right up here. There we go. So, yeah, so maybe. Yeah, those look. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, those look good. Those look. Uh, uh, correct. Those look correct. And I better put them up before the darkness comes. It looks like all the colonists are going to bed. So let's make sure we get <laughs> we get safe again. Make sure we're all in close. Yeah, so I'm going to... I guess I'll just replace some of these walls with these. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now uh, let's get... Oops, no, didn't want, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, let's just do this. There we go. Put that light back so we can see what we're doing. There we go. Lights. Put another one. Oop, I'm out of lights. And let there be lights. There we go. He's taking a dip. So yeah, there's definitely a lot. There's definitely many more zombies here going on. Let's see when they first start hitting him. Oh yeah, nice. So he's hitting them. For, he got a pretty good range there. Nice. Nice. He's doing all the work. <laughs> Who is? Pile up. <laughs> yeah, I don't mind it so much. It's not too bad. I like it. It's actually, I think, almost better than those. A little bit more realistic, right? Like we should have made these structures out of these. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Cool. Well, I'm 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 more happy with that. Cuz I was thinking we needed to go to like I said with the stone stone structures. But uh I think this is good. Okay. Cool. Cool cool cool. Let's see how our wheat's doing. Looks like it's getting pretty tall. Yeah, it should be ready to harvest, uh, I think, by the time the colonists wake up, or some of it should be. We should be swimming in wheat, baby, swimming in wheat. And our new berry farmer has his berry bushes bushed and down. Nice. Okay, so we should be in a good position here. Okay. So we can definitely do the porridge. This is going to increase it by 15, but I do want, oh, you know what? I just thought of something. Do we have a merchant's hub? We're going to have to see, but this is, it's a little concerning that it's going to make it, it's going to, it's going to almost double our threat level. So, yeah, but we definitely want to get it. Oh, that's 30. Columnist, though, this actually requires columnist points. Okay, so let's go ahead and complete that. And then let's look at how many log walls we're making. I think they're being made at the cutter. I think we really need to ramp up that production. Yeah, so log walls. We only have 105 at the moment. Let's go ahead and do 450. We can leave this on medium priority. Uh, no, actually, let's do 300. So they'll, they'll make the planks first, and then the log walls. 
And yeah, so that, that seems good. But they're making the firewood first. I think I'm going to make another woodcutter here and put it here. And then hire for that. There we go. And... Perfect. They're making the porridge person. Whatever it is. So... And let's hire for that. And we're almost up, so we have three more jobs to go. We're at 48 beds, but 45 colonists. So let's go ahead and put some more beds up here. And how many have we got? 10. So we'll put 10 more beds. And just here. And then here, here, oops, give them a double bed, <laughs> just in case someone, someone wants to couple up, there we go, yeah, and I'm going to need to finish this off as well, get start giving these guys a roof, but for now, we should be good, we can actually put a few more down here, Yeah, I think we're looking good. And this is this is awesome up here. I'm very I'm very proud of this structure. Yeah, they're not ready to harvest just quite yet. So but they should be ready to harvest I think by the end of the day. But uh, yeah. So the next thing to look at is our downstairs here, our basement level. So I would like to start really developing this. And as I was looking at before, we can only go down 30 until we get out of range of our flag. But we can go this way and we can go this way pretty far and that way, but we don't want to go that way. Um, and I'll show you. Well, that's fine. I can show you. Well, I can show you just here. So what's going to happen? We'll just make a little hallway here. If I can get this out. Come on, guys. There we go. So what happens is even if you're underground, but you're out of the range of the flag, zombies can actually spawn outside and to check that we need to look at let's get a light in here so we know what we're doing but we need to look at we need to look at our flag here so our banner tool use our banner tool to see where we are but yeah so we don't want to go too far this way because we know the edge is over here so we're not there yet. Should be hitting it fairly soon. Let's go a few more. Nope, we're still not there. Let's put another light here. But I like to do this because I like to do like put out like how far we are because then you don't make this whole underground thing and then you're caught off guard by zombies coming up from the underground. I'm surprised we're not there yet. Although the stairs account for a lot so we may have a little bit more ways to go here. Yeah, I, I know we're getting close. We have to be getting close. Have to be getting close. Let me see here. So I'm looking at the steps. Yeah, they're pretty far out. So, okay. Do two. 
two more here and then check. Yeah, there it is. So that blackness right there, if I was to leave it, we'll put some log walls in here. <laughs> Might as well. But if I was to leave that space open, a zombie can actually um, spawn right there. Yeah, we need actually one more. Oops. We need one more level like that. There we go. So now we're safe. Okay. But that's how far we want to go that way. And I want to kind of do the same thing with these directions as well. Because I want to map out exactly how far I can go. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to dig out and start making rooms down here. Because we can have, instead of having all our barracks up here and all our jobs up here, we can have a secondary barracks and jobs down that way. But this is, let's see here. So we're like one. Oh, <laughs> I wish it was an easier way to count. Well, yeah, let's just do it with these because these grass blocks are easier to count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, I think. Twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. 9, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. So there's about 34 out that way until we hit that spawn zone for zombies. So if we go down this way and go this way, so about 30 blocks in, like there. But you know what? I'm not going to do it there. I'll just, just I'll start it here because this will expand this hallway. All right, so I'm just going to do a little jump cut here, and I'll be right back. Okay, so it's right there. Okay, so it looks like we went two in too far. Let's go ahead and fill that in. I was counting until I wasn't counting. <laughs> I think that's correct. Take that out. Yeah, there we go. That's correct. So put the log template in there. All right, so we have this much room down here to do it, to do whatever we need. And I remember, like, before the updates, we could have, like, diggers and, 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 and construction workers. But let me see. In the science menu, I know they're in here. And if I remember correctly, they're kind of in this area here. Poison, science, grass, rope trap. Again, I wish these were categorized. So, I would know what I'm looking at because it's very easy to miss it. And where are you? I know you're here. It, this is interesting here. Like, you, you may want to, you may be thinking, well, why do I want grass and dirt? I think there's different biomes that we don't have it naturally in those biomes. Like, right now, in this biome, we can actually go, like, outside and and grab a bunch of it just just you know whatever but i think in certain biomes like deserts and uh, maybe like winter that i think oh i remember the glider those were fun i think that compass why don't we have that just unlocked that should that hmm, okay never mind um but anyways yeah so it, it's it it, it goes ahead um, uh, it goes ahead and like it in 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 oh my god what am I trying to say <laughs> in other zones you may need it is what I'm saying the grass and dirt production but right now we don't need it where is the uh, special digger okay there we go what do we need we need Digger areas. How do we unlock that though? So, is that a thing? Here it is. Digger. Digger. Ah, okay. So we need the writer. 
Why would you need a writer and colony points? And scrolls of knowledge. So we need writer for the scrolls of knowledge. Okay. Uh, what do we need for the writer? We need leather and copper tools. Now leather again. We're gonna need. We're gonna need hides. So we're gonna need the chicken farmer for that. I think. Anyways. So we have mapped out those things from there and there. So this gives us a whole huge area that we can now just dig all of this out and then and then use it. So, but what was going off on there is that before the update, we had, I think, diggers unlocked early on and we can just highlight an area and then the digger will dig it out. But we don't have that at the moment. So we're gonna have to do it manually. But not today. <laughs> what I do want to do, um, yeah, what I do want to do is go ahead and start going in here. So how many do we need? How many, how many is it? So I'm going to, I'm going to do a count this time so I know exactly where it is. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, I'm... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Lucky number 21. So we'll need 21 going that way from this side. And then we'll just need to uh, go that way. So yeah, so 21, I'm gonna do another jump cut here. Probably not a time lapse, just jump cut, and then I'll be right back. All right, and we're through. And that's it. So we have, let's put a little light in here. Just no, not there, gonna burn our face. There, there. Just make sure that we got light. So again, uh, 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 no, no. there we go. So again, we have this whole huge area. Now we just have to dig it all out. I'm not going to do it this stream or this video. And uh, but what I'll do is I will do it in the in the meantime until the next video. But I think that's a good place to stop. And I appreciate everybody coming by and watching. And I think we made some pretty good progress here. Let's look at our wheat. We should be getting more wheat. Yeah, so now we have 129, which is perfect. We were we were really going slow on that. Let's go ahead and what were we gonna do? We we're going to so that requires leather though. Um, but this one here. So this is the one we are. With. So we have plenty of wheat now. Wow. So let's go ahead and complete that, and that'll be perfect. So cool. All right, guys, thank you for coming by and watching. I will see everybody very, very soon. And I think we're making some really good progress here. So yeah, bye for now, guys.